Rusia recunoaște că a suferit pierderi importante în războiul din Ucraina. A spus-o purtătorul de cuvânt al Kremlinului pentru Sky News. A fost un interviu în care a negat din nou atrocitățile comise de soldații Moscovei și în care a spus că Rusia speră să încheie curând așa numita operațiune militară specială. Și a mai zis ceva, la Kremlin nu există nicio îngrijorare că Vladimir Putin ar putea fi judecat pentru crimele de război comise de soldații săi în Ucraina. We have we have significant losses of troops and uh, it's 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 a huge tragedy for us. Now about two regions, Kiev and the Chernigov regions. Uh, so actually the troops were really withdrawn from that region as an act of a goodwill to 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 lift tension from those regions. Are you determined to take Mariupol, whatever the human cost? Mariupol is going to be uh, liberated from. Uh, nationalistic battalions. Pounding of civilian buildings, the pounding of a hospital, that's liberation, is it? Well, hospital, hospital was a fake. We insist that the whole situation, the situation is butcher, is a well-staged uh, insinuation. And those dead bodies there were not victim of Russian military personnel. We do hope that in coming days, in In, in, in foreseeable future, this operation will reach uh, its goals or will finish it by the negotiations. Does Mr. Putin worry about ending up in a war crimes court? No, he's not. I don't consider it this, this possibility to be, to be realistic.